Hello. Plants vs. Zombies. We're on World 5, Level 1. Uh, yeah. We're almost done with this damn game. So that's cool. Hey, Cousin Eddie. They even found a way onto your roof. Those are some persistent zombies. You'll need cabbage bolts, blah, 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 freaking blah. Uh, okay, so what's going on on the roof here? Hello, everybody. Hello, everybody. Hello, everybody. Hello, everybody. Hello, 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 everybody. Okay. Nine slots is 20 freaking thousand. We ain't getting that anytime soon. So I don't even know if it's worth it to just rock. He he just spoke. He, he's speaking words, but okay. I'm sorry. Okay, we'll buy. We're going to buy the flowers. All right. We're going to buy the flowers. We're going to put them there. We need the cabbage bolts. Jalapeno might be the way to go. Honestly, uh, maybe some tall nuts as well. Uh, what else do we want? There's no, there's no spiky dudes. So we don't need that. Um, Jesus, this is, this is a tough one. We're going to take these two guys and maybe get something working with that. Uh, but this is, this is a sketchy thing to do in general. I genuinely don't know what to do with this round. I, I'm going to take the squash. You gotta keep in mind, we're gonna be getting some better, uh, some better roof plants. Oh, this music is lit, dude. I'm loving this. This was not in the game, and if it was, then my, uh, my eight-year-old brain does not remember it. This is lit, though. Okay, so here's how it works. We're gonna get down our flowers, and then... We're going to do our best to upgrade them over time to be the twin flowers. How do I want to do this? Uh, Yeah, I'm going to put that there. It's a bad idea. I mean, that being said, it's hard to screw up the first level uh, of a world. But I want to get as many flowers in as possible right now. I also don't want to mess up by putting a... Uh, I don't want to mess up by putting a pea shooter in like row two. I think pea shooters can only be in row one. But I genuinely can't remember. <laughs> Which is not good for us. All things considered. Okay, there's there's the twin flower. And he's going to generate twice the sun uh, of a normal guy. As he did right there. It worked out beautifully. I'm happy he's a human being in our lives here. We will unlock the pots. Uh, as probably the plant that we get for finishing this level, in all honesty. Because they can be eaten, uh, as you can see right there. Get the cabbage bolts in. Once we have the pot, we can kind of... <laughs> comes out a little bit different. There, there you go. The unforeseen plant in Plants vs. Zombies. Hemp. <laughs> but, uh... What, what... Oh, Jesus Lord. Once we get the, uh... <laughs> once we get the pot unlocked... Uh, we can make these levels into our own style. Because we can actually place pea shooters down and stuff along those lines. So it'll work out okay. We just got to get to that point. Uh, and we will actually, we're going to spiral out of control pretty quickly on this level. If we start, okay, he's going to be annoying. You want to not be a jerk hole, buddy? He was a jerk hole. Well, that's what we get, honestly. When you let your heart win. Oh, oh, what oh, oh, no. That's a Paramore reference. I don't know why I made a Paramore reference. Paramore hasn't been relevant for uh, several years now. When's the last time Paramore put out an album? It had to have been several years by now. Are they even still together? Paramore might not even be a band anymore, let alone, you know, making music. I don't know. As you can see, uh, the cabbage pole is real horrible. I mean, it's not a good, it's not a good plant at all. Uh, it's mainly just our means of success in this first level here. We'll probably slap him into each one. Uh, although we might get corn shooter next, and I absolutely like the corn shooter more than the cabbage pole for reasons that you'll see probably in this next uh, level here. But hey, we lost a pot down here too. I want a refund on these pots, buddy. This is our final wave, though, so a lot of me doesn't really care, but go ahead, take it. 
And see how much I care. Okay, now that's just mean, honestly. Have a, have a jalapen, though. Get the hell out of my house, buddy. All right, we are going to succeed here. Uh, we don't have lawnmowers on the roof. I just picked up on that. I mean, that is a pretty straightforward idea when, <laughs> when you think about it. If you had a lawnmower on your roof, chances are that there's uh, more problems at hand than just zombies on your roof. You also have some mental issues. Okay, we do unlock the pot right away. We do want the pot. Uh, it's just, what do I want the pot more than? You got some new items for sale? Oh, whoop de freaking do The roof cleaners. For the love of God. Uh, I mean, realistically, we should probably buy these. 3,000 is a lot, though. But the series is also ending, so we might as well. Uh, if I can go through this game without ever losing a level, uh, I think that's a pretty good success here. We'll buy, do the pot. We need the cabbage still. We'll do those two guys, and we'll do a tall nut. And then we just need the fail, fail case scenario, which I'll do the jalapeno. Right? Yeah, sure. Why not? I wish the tin, the tin flowers. I wish the tin flowers. Uh, no, I wish the twin flowers would work on their own and not have to be placed onto another guy. But then they'd be like stupidly powerful. There goes my phone, Ripperuskis. It always sits on my lap just in case I need to like research something in the middle of a video or something like that. And then I sit in my chair like a freaking bird, and it falls off my lap 24/7. And I suppose that's my own damn fault. I'm not going to sit and blame anybody but me, but still, a little bit saddening. Uh, we are going to do a layer of cabbage bolts as we did last time. I am also going to start getting twin flowers in basically ASAP. Probably before we even put in another cabbage bolt, I'm going to try and get a twin flower in. We only need two more of these damn dudes to pay out and then we can get one in. There's one, there's two, there's that. Skip to my loo, move on with our day, life is good, happy-go-lucky feeling, hooked on a feeling, dan 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 I'm high and believing, okay. With that, we good to go. Uh, I do want to, and this is going to be the level that we tested in, because I'm not sure that we can uh, afford to test this in a future uh, level here. We're going to put down a pea shooter right here. And see if it, it doesn't make it there. Oh. Am I a little bit angry? I'm not angry. I'm just disappointed. That's a little bit sucky, honestly. I thought we maybe had a chance that it was going to go over. But I guess it's only that first row on the slanted that can. Oh, well, man. I mean, crap happens. There's not much you can do about it. We lose out on 200, uh, 200 buckarooskis here. But that's okay. Uh, we're gonna get a double shooter in next. Uh, as soon as possible. And by soon, I mean, like, for the love of God, give me it soon. This is asking for disaster. This is a really great way for us to lose this shooter right away. I'm not sure what was going through my head to think that this was a good idea. I'm an idiot. Now, I'm actually just like the world's biggest potato. So that's good. We're going to put that guy in. We've now wasted 400 on this level. And we're going to lose a bunch of pots too. Look, I never claim to be a smart man. I mean, I do claim that in almost every video I make. But I'm not a smart man, Gen A. I'm kind of an idiot. Now, this is no exception. I mean, that's just bad play by me. Uh, get another twin flower in. We're getting like 10 sun now from flowers, which is a crap load, all things considered. Okay, you know what? Just take care of that guy for now. We've got a lot of bad stuff going on. We need damn pea shooters. Oh, we need a damn catapult that doesn't blow. Because that's our main problem right now, is this damn catapult blows. 
I also am trying to figure out if we actually need to do something about this guy. Because he's kind of going through all of our lines of defense right now. Okay. Eh, we're doing fine. Uh, no problemo, honestly. A huge wave of zombies approaching? I've never felt more ready. <laughs> You're telling me that I don't look ready? Says who? We're perfectly okay. Can't you sense my perfectness? Alright, another twin flower. Give me all the sun in the world. If I have all the sun, we'll never fail. I just want to get some Gatling peas in, man. Uh, I'll tell you right now. We need this guy here. And then we need a Jalapeno ASAP. Uh, and it's going to go right in this lane. So it's basically just a waiting game for uh, 50 gold here. There it is. Jalapeno. No, Jalepa, yes. <laughs> and we'll get that taken care of. Okay. We'll be fine here. Uh, we just made a couple of boneheaded decisions. And while it didn't cost us a lot, uh, it still made life a little bit uh, funky for a while. But what are you going to do? It's the, it's the last levels of the game. These are not easy. These are the hardest levels of the game. Besides maybe fog levels. I suppose fog levels are maybe harder, but I don't know. Th these levels are difficult. They're going to get rid of my... That is that is honestly just unkind. No, it took my pea shooter. Oh, what the hell, man? You are not allowed to do that, buddy. So we've wasted 600. <laughs> 600 damn sun in this round so far. And in route to more, honestly. And this bucket head is going to be an issue too. Uh, this bucket head's actually going to be an issue. Get get out of here! Oh, I hate him so much. Okay, yeah, now he's going to be a problem here too. Get more catapults. I I actually don't know what to do at this point. These damn men are everywhere. I need to place a tall nut here. These guys have my number. My defense is gone. I mean, I'm just I'm uh, I'm a sitting duck in Congress, <laughs> waiting waiting to be evicted from uh, the capitalistic regime. I I don't know what to do with this. I'm just gonna let him eat all my stuff. I don't know, place a gelato. Oh no, he's good. He's dead. We're gonna let him eat all my stuff, and then we'll put down Jalapeno when he's all ready to die. You know what? We're gonna put this... You're kidding me, right? That's 800 lost on this level. All I wanted was a little bit of happiness, and the game said no to me. It's the final wave. Oh, we don't deserve to even make it to the final wave. This has been one of our worst levels ever. Oh, go ahead. Steal my pot. See how much I care. The only time where you're uh, not mad if someone steals your pot. Alright. Die, please. Thank you. Luckily, we have all the sun we could ever need. And honestly, since we don't really need any other stuff here, say hello to my little friend, the Gatling P. Let's go. Alright. There's Cornipult. We're honestly just going to get rid... We're going to do this exact same lineup, but just get rid of the Cabbage Pult. Because Corn Man is so much better. We got a ladder, bro. <laughs> I don't really care about ladder, bro. Frankly. He can kind of do whatever the hell he wants. Uh, and I'm just going to let him. What else do I need? Jalapin, though. No bucket heads, which makes my life a living beauty. We are put bringing the pots back further and further. And it's making me a little bit upset. But I won't say a word to the people in charge. They know what they're doing. Can't believe we're almost done with PVZ. We're probably gonna like it's gonna be two more videos after this one to finish up the game. It's wild, dude. This series has flown. We have been doing it for a few weeks, but it definitely hasn't felt like it. Get buttered. <laughs> I love it, man. It was always one of my favorite plants. The cornipulter. 
The Colonel Pult, or whatever the hell it's called. Such a good plant. I don't care if the corn barely does any damage, the butter is so good. And we're basically, we're not going to be stupid this time. Uh, we're going to make sure we get in cornipults everywhere before we start to put in pea shooters. It's just more intelligent to do this. But I do want to get in twin flowers uh, ASAP. Just because the, uh, the friggin' cooldown time is so bad on them. It's worth it to get them in immediately. So that you're ready when the next one uh, produces. Okay. This is our level. This is the one where we blow it out of the water and nobody even comes close to us. We'll get some Gatling peas in, some Twin Flowers, Colonel Pults, Colonel Sanders, Colonel on a Linux terminal. There's going to be Colonels everywhere, man. And don't forget the butter. I can't believe it ain't butter, honestly. Okay, we'll start the uh, array of pea shooters now. We basically, uh, the back row, always flowers. The middle three rows is just all catapults, man. As many catapults as we can get put in, the happier my life is going to be. Give me a bunch of catapults. We will live a happy life. When we get the watermelons in, we'll have those in the middle row. And then maybe another corn, honestly. And that would be the dream setup. Now, a lot of the time, we're never going to even see... Uh, most of our master plans come to power because we're just going to run out of waves, but, and then obviously you put a, uh, I'd actually like for the tall nut to be one up from that and then have a, uh, fireball behind the pea shooter, but obviously we don't even have a fireball in this one, so no big concerns, no worries about a thing, every little thing's going to be all right. Continue to get your get your pots in i have full uh full-fledged belief that our uh corn men can probably handle this entire level the waves they'd start to get a little bit in eh, but corn men too strong they're very good and they will take care of business absolutely it sucks that a butter was wasted on him I mean, what do we do with this guy? We're just gonna hope that somehow... Yeah, double butter. Let's go. We're gonna... Oh, triple butter? The triple butt. Not the quadruple butt, though. It was almost a quadruple butt. He'll be taken care of fine. We are good. Okay. This level's going great. Get another uh, repeater in. In this row here. And we're gonna need some butt to make this one work. <laughs> I don't know if I like uh, shortening butter to butt right now. Something just don't seem right about that. Okay. Please uh, slam a butt down. You need a butt right now. You need a butt. There's the butt. And he got him anyway. Damn. First mistake. Calculated risk. It ain't the end of the world. This man will be dead before he knows it. Pea shooter. Take care of him. Get it going. And we're pretty close to having uh, shooters in every lane before uh before the first wave which is great once we get this last guy in it's then going to be uh it's gonna be quadra shooter gatling p time ladder man is never going to see any uh major action here we will have him dead in no time he did just climb right up our ladder but he'll be dead in no time <laughs> Now all the other zombies are right there, and they can climb up that ladder. It's not really how I want that to be done, but... Sometimes crap happens, I suppose. I will Gatling this ladder. Get Gatling. Get Gatling. Get Gatling. He is trying to eat me. He's the worst human being. Ladder man is real freaking annoying. Just want to throw that out there. Get, get your weapon out. Alright, ladder man. I see you. I see you. You're a real pain in the rear, Mr. Ladder man. 
Not to be confused with David Letterman. Very different. You suck butt, buddy. I needed to suck more butter. Screw the Gatling pee. Give me more corn. I want to butter all my enemies up. Oh, this guy down here is going to be a problem. He going to be a problem. Oh, no, uh, uh, don't you dare, buddy. He moves so freaking fast. Like, you actually can't get to the damn guy. Stop, my friend. He is so excited with his ladder. Okay. I suppose just keep, uh, keep putting in corn, guys. We, we don't need another twin flower. That's just a waste of money. It's the last damn wave. Keep your, uh... We're, we're gonna lose this guy. Come on. Okay, now we're, we're definitely gonna lose him. Rest in pepperoni. We're still making big mistakes. Uh, you know what? You chill on him. I see a rising concern down here. It's, it's definitely a rising concern. Please, for the love of God, butter. He's done it. Okay. We're fine. Final wave. We've at least beaten the level. We might lose all of our lawnmowers, but... We've at least beaten the level. You're the worst human being on this earth. I feel fine about that. Middle lane is super dead. This lane needs some help. Have a, have a tall nut, buddy. And then we'll just take care of bottom lane. I mean, these levels are hard. Uh, I'm not going to deny that. But I think we've got this relatively on lock. At least sort of. <laughs> Maybe. They seem to be on lock. Beats the hell out of me, man. We, we need the damn watermelons. They do so much for us. Just to be fully twin flowered out. Slap that guy there. But this level's done. Uh, I think it might be watermelon next. It might be caffeine pill. Yeah, it's coffee bean. Because they want us to use this on uh, the magnet. To take care of ladder men. And, and trust me. It's really tempting. Oh my god, it's really tempting. Uh, okay. Let's do... This, 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 this. We have no failsafe. You know what? We're, we're, we're gonna try something. Uh... We're going to make our only shooter corn men. This is an awful idea. Uh, th this oh god, I don't want to I don't want to hit it. Ah, uh, this is such a bad idea. I right, we're going to try it. I'm letting you know right now this might be our first uh first loss of the series. Relying on corn men might not be the best way to go, but I have belief in the corn, man. Believe in the kern and the butt. Kernels and butter are the way to go, man. There's three freaking waves of this one. Uh, we do need to make sure we get a magnet shroom down and get one down ASAP. Uh, and they're going to sit right at the front, kinda. You know what? Get, just start getting the kernels in. Our only hope is having so many corn guys that it just, they can take care of business, but to say that I'm a little skeptical would be, uh, truthful. I am fairly skeptical about this. We'll see what happens, though. Luckily, they put corn all in one lane, which is really nice. I can take some time to build. Put enemies all in one lane with my one corn is what I meant to say. It came out a little funky. But this is this is a great start for us. Okay, now we put in a corn here. We got one twin flower in. 
They're going to give us all of the stuff we need to succeed. I think we're going to put Magnet Man here. Now, they don't fall back asleep, right? They'll be awake forever. He's going to go there. And there's going to be another one here. And that's going to take care of those guys. That should cover every lane. Now, obviously, they, they take time to get rid of the stuff, etc., etc. But give me another corn right there. I'm a little bit worried about this guy. I think it's like a third chance of getting corn. I, I don't know the math behind it. I'm sure I could probably look it up, but... It seems that it's about one in every three. Uh, somebody, if you want to track a, uh, a corn plant throughout the series and see exactly how many times it fires butter versus corn, one, you'd waste your time, but two, it would be interesting to find out. My guess is it's around one-third, but it definitely seems a little bit less than a half. Or more than a half, less than a half, less than a half. <laughs> Math is hard. We haven't even seen an enemy in the bottom two lanes. It's good. I'm happy about it. I'm a bit concerned about this, though. There's a butt. Good. Start putting, like, double butt at that guy. Do not, do not. That's okay. That is okay. Just get as much butt in there as possible. The problem is we have this on lock right now. When they start sending multiple zombies in a wave, we're, we're donezo. We're also donezo with this guy down here. I'm probably just going to wait and jalapeno him. Which is sucky, but... It's the right way to do this. You're telling me another zombie's not coming down that lane right now. This is such a waste. Uh, that sucks. But that's fine. Get, get, get double jalapenos going. We gotta wake this guy up too. Not double jalapenos, double corn down here. Wake this guy up. We know we're gonna be using it shortly. Fire some butter. Are you actually kidding me? I'm so mad. Jesus Lord, man. Stop wrecking my, uh, my magnet man. We know we're going to see one here. That's going to need a magnet done to him. And that's the plan. There's nothing. There are three freaking waves to this level. Wake those men up. Oh, wake me up before you butter. Don't leave me hanging on like a butter. Hey, a diamond. A diamond day. Oh, wake me up before you butter. Keep me dancing tonight. I want to be your corn. Rest in peace, George Michaels. He is dead. He didn't die from my rendition. Don't worry. Okay. We're starting to get those, uh, the mad amounts of Amone. His ladder is donezo. Get out of here. I never want to see it ever again, my boy. Out of three guys, if it's one third, it should fire a damn butter every time. Thank you. And he should die now. Three corn is enough to handle stuff. I have firm belief in that. I'm a bit concerned I'm going to need some more, uh, Pogo Man will be taken care of. I'm, gonna, I'm concerned I'm going to need some more magnets, but so far, so good. And we're not even to the second wave. Okay. I suppose just more, more corn everywhere. As much corn as one man can do is as much corn as I want. 
Goodbye, ladder. Peace out. There's butter flying everywhere. People killing, people dying. Butter filling, butter flying. And we're getting mad money. <laughs> this is actually a really fantastic setup. Uh, and I'm a little bit angry about it. All things considered. Because it shouldn't be. We should not have our only offense be corn and have this work. But here we are. Is definitely working. I was gonna get tall nuts down uh, in the lanes with the magnets. But they take so long to recharge that it's gonna be a little while. There's really no other defense I have planned here. It's just getting tall nuts in. This is going fine. We'll probably end off the episode after this level here. Which then lines us up perfectly. We have two more waves left. Holy crap, dude. It lines us up perfectly for uh, two more videos, essentially. Like three to four levels in the next one. And then you'll have the finale level and call it a day at the end there. It'll work out day okay. This is showing how well we can handle waves here. Lane 2 and 4 have a little bit of issues. They don't have as many, uh, as many people, but shooters. Although top lane is struggling a little bit too. Not much we can do about that though. They just gotta take care of business. We'll get a tall nut in there eventually. Final wave's gonna be interesting. We have 800 gold. There's nothing I can do about it. I wonder if there's an achievement for hitting a thousand. That seems like something stupid they'd do. Well, I didn't get an achievement, so. I'm gonna roll with no. There's probably not one. It's a nonchalant 950 gold. It's no biggie. Makes him feel good about life. Say goodbye to your ladder, my boy. My sweet prince. My sweet child. Stop. Uh, you might get through. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, he didn't. That's what I'm worried about is another, uh, another magnet man. I feel like we might need one. And what we might do is do, like... One here. Cause he can he can get from both lanes. And then we just slap down a uh, a protector in front of him now. To protect that magnet. It's like a little bit of a waste, but I feel better about having three magnets here. It basically makes uh the damn cone heads the hardest enemy. And we know we can take care of them. So this works out okay. Surprisingly, this is very, very effective. I don't want to run like this forever, though. Uh, it's going to be situational for these last couple of episodes. If we have a lot of magnet men, then obviously the, the magnet plant is going to be best. But the problem with the magnet plant is he takes up two spots because we need the caffeine bean. Coffee bean. That's sucky. It's final wave, though. Uh, so we have one. I'm just gonna take it upon myself to jalapeno a couple people. And, uh, we're basically good to go. So, cool. Uh, the level that I thought would go horrible instead went insanely well. Uh, my judgment gets an A-plus for today. And, uh, yeah. I'm a happy camper. I'm a happy boy. We'll see what plant we get. It's hopefully the watermelon. Uh, I don't remember the other stuff. No, it's a watering can. What the hell does this do? Oh, it unlocks the garden. Oh, I don't give a damn about the garden, but you can play Zen garden mode. Oh, hey, would you look at that? You found a watering can. Here's a couple sprouts. Grow them. They'll make money. Yeah, this was the, uh, this was their way of basically copying Farmville. 
It was their way of, uh... Making it where you could actually afford the stuff that they had in-game. <laughs> if I'm being honest here. But that's okay. I, I'll, I'll sit and humor them. These things are ready, like, every day or some crap like that. They need fertilizer. Oh, yeah, that's right. And then I have to buy fertilizer. So now I gotta buy these things. Oh, I don't want to do these. Bug spray keeps them happy. I do not give a damn. We got a nice little pretty flower and then a nice little other pretty flower. That's all you can do for now. Fantastic. Come back later. I will come back later, but we're going to come back uh, way later. And by way later, I mean tomorrow to play some uh, some some more Plants vs. Zombies. We got a bunch of bungee guys in this next level. It's very quite annoying. Okay, no, this is for next level. Goodbye, my friends. See you in the next video. Peace out.